It's the same freedom they feel. Great mental boost. Um, physically, it's helped me with my balance, um, like with the circulation, uh, helps reduce the spasticity in my legs and stuff. I'm sitting all day. So, yeah, it's uh, very emotionally rewarding, too. Most of the really nice to people and the one I like is really nice. I just can't believe it. And also, like, flying horses in different ways kind of helps my balance. Because humans and horses share a similar gait or walk, it's a perfect match for many of the participants. It's been said that equitherapy allows riders to sit taller and smile more ultimately extending their dreams beyond the confines of their disabilities. So getting on a horse, being able to walk even though they cannot walk, um, is a true great experience for that individu individual and they uh, experience freedom that they never had before. The physical benefits are endless. In some cases, increased respiration, increased brain activity, balance, and much more. Each rider has a different goal set for them and is assisted by a trained volunteer and horse. Sometimes the goal might even be uh, as simple as have fun. Many individuals with disabilities forget how to have fun since they have to endure that challenge every day of their life. For volunteer Richard Wright, it's a life lesson. After his daughter Allie's life was taken two years ago in a car accident. Seeing some of the kids when they're up there, the horses and the smiles on their faces, that's what makes it all worth it. Besides donating Allie's memorial money to buy a new saddle and miniature horse for Sunrise, Wright now volunteers each week in his daughter's memory. Oh, when I'm with the horses, Allie's with me. And I wish she was here. Um, and she is. Because um, I wish, I think she'd be proud to see what I'm doing and what we're doing and you know, the steps we've taken to keep this going, to help keep it going. Allie is certainly smiling right along with each rider who sits high atop these beautiful animals. A ride that exercises the mind, the body, and most of all, the spirit. Because of what you've done, not because.